Hello, welcome to Here's My Garden, the hopefully inspirational gardening channel where I'm just trying to urge as many people as I can to grow their own food. Today I'd like to talk a little bit about carrots. If you're just starting out gardening, um, it can be a fun thing to grow, especially if you have kids. Um, I know a lot of children love to eat carrots. It can be a fun activity for them. When planting carrots, the seeds are extremely small and those tiny little fingers of theirs could come in handy actually. Because uh, with, with carrots, one thing you have to do, you, you gotta thin them out. Um, now, somebody like me, I get all willy-nilly and I just sprinkle them all in. Um, uh, what I did here, I've got three rows. Basically just drew a line in the dirt with my finger and sprinkled them all in. But as they start coming up, you gotta come out and you gotta start thinning them out, which means spacing. Um, about an inch, inch and a half apart. Now, I've had to thin twice because like I said, I get a little cavalier when I'm putting my seeds in. Um, next year, I might try to be a little more careful. Uh, the unfortunate thing with what I do is I use an entire pack of seeds just in this area here. There's my carrots, three rows of carrots an entire pack of seeds and I had to throw half of them away because as I'm thinning them out there's uh you know what are you going to do with them I did learn a trick you can transplant very small seedlings of carrots uh, just take a stick just poke a hole and just gently feed that little dangler right down in there and uh, just fill it in with dirt I've got a couple that I tried some it looks like they took okay some maybe not at all but yeah so when you're thinning turn back around here I said you could you can see the spacing here okay now let's uh let's just see what we got going right now see look at that now that's that's not much but that is edible um somebody asked how can you tell when they're ready well Here's one that doesn't even have a top on it. You can see the orange sticking out. If you see a little crown of orange sticking out, yeah, they're good to go. Um, but you can also just grab them. There. That one's not bad. Um, I'm gonna actually going to thin these out a little bit more today just to, because I've got some that are doing well and some that I missed. So I'm just gonna randomly reach in here and if I got some big ones, try to pull them out. Oh, that one broke off. See, like I said, if I can do this, you guys, you can do this. My ground's not even soft enough for what I'm trying to do. I'm gonna have to get a shovel later. See, it's a mess out here. But it's growing carrots and that's what I'm after, carrots. Um, like I said, a great activity for kids. If you have small children who like carrots, it can be a lot of fun. Um, if you, oh, excuse me, there I go. See, look at that. Um, if you're new to gardening and you don't want to put in the time that it's going to take, because like I said, you do have to put some extra time in with thinning them out. Um, Again, a good way to avoid that is to be careful with your seed placement. Um, carrots can be grown twice a year, where I'm at. Start them in the spring for your summer harvest and then late summer for a fall harvest. And I said, I don't have any seeds, but I got this guy right here who went to seed. So hopefully I can get some viable seeds out of that and I'll get a second crop for free. Um, that's my goal here is to try to get as much seeds from my own garden for next year. And that's gonna help make it easier to give stuff away. Because if it's not costing me anything but a little bit of work, I'd be happy to do it. Because that's kind of my mission. At Here's my garden. And again, if I can do this, come on people, you can do this. Oh my God, I don't know if I can do this. <laughs> All right, I'm getting my shovel.
I've had enough. I'm fed up. Where are you at, you little booger? Uh, anyway, so yeah, thinning carrots. You definitely want to thin your carrots. I tried one year not to, and I they grew up in weird clumps. Um, again, I don't have the best conditions. My soil is not as loose as it should be. Uh, I've got way too many rocks, which means I get carrots that come out looking like this and like this and weird crooks and they're ugly. Won't find those in the store, which is sad because most commercial operations just throw that stuff away. And that's such a waste, especially with how many people in this world can't get food. Um, you know, there may be people I know who can't get food, which is why I'm trying to help you produce it yourselves. Um, it's, it's the way to go. It's the way to go. See, here's one. This looks like a nice one. Now you see, there's a big one right here. There's a bunch of small ones. So if I can get this big one out without disturbing the ones next to it, you bugger. All right, my soil's way too hard for me to be doing this one-handed. So I'm gonna have to uh, end the video a little earlier than I wanted to so I can actually get some of these freaking carrots out of the ground. Um, and again, carrots, good for you. Here's my garden.